be honest with you. I ain't got shit. <laughs> I ain't <laughs> got shit. Hey, keep it in world it's your girl ambi and we are back again with another episode of social status and media and today we're in the studio with Vert. what's going on what's up, what's up? so we was in the studio today what song were you working on i was working on this song called clove no talented just don't bad just don't cat bad and she's the female rapper yeah one of the hardest in the city Okay, so what made you want to do a female feature versus a male feature? Well, I don't even do features. Uh, she just, she all, I can see potential in it. So, mm-hmm. you know, we got to try to see what we can put together. Okay, okay so when are you planning on dropping a song? You don't know? No, you got to have know. some type of date. <laughs> Okay, well, we'll be on the lookout. Now, you real grind before you shine a lot, and I seen you hashtag it under a lot of your posts on Instagram. So, did you come up with this hashtag or this movement, or like, what is it? Yeah, it's like, grind before you shine. It's not label. It's just my mentality. Mm-hmm. Like, you can be any type of person doing anything, but... When it come down to it, you got to grind before you shine. Like, right. you got to put in the work before it pay off. You know what I'm saying? Like they say, you, you reap what you sow. You know what I'm saying? Mm-hmm. The fruits okay, of your labor. Fruit. You know what I'm saying? So, it's like, I done went through so much. And I figured out I was going the wrong route. I was trying to shine, but I wasn't putting in the work to right. actually shine. So, I learned that you got to grind before you shine. I like it. Now, are you just focusing on putting out music right now, or are you looking into doing tours and doing any showcases? Tours and showcases, that's my ultimate goal. Mm-hmm. But right now, I'm just trying to figure my crap, trying to find myself, right. trying to see, like, trying to see how my music sounds to me and how it make me feel. And if it make me feel good, I know that the people gonna take it. So do you feel like a lot of your listeners are influenced by your music? I don't have a lot of listeners. How many do you have a lot? Do you probably, think you probably know? Probably two or three. Okay, well, it don't matter. Do you think they're influenced <laughs> by your music? I mean, hey, everybody yeah, yeah, started they, off they with definitely. like two or three fans. The, the, so it the, don't matter. The little bit that I have, they mm-hmm. definitely influenced by them. Like, okay. they hit me up, let me know, like, they motivate them. They, they will keep me going. Right. The, the little amount of support that I got, mm-hmm. it keep me going. Okay. Now, if y'all notice, we both have on orange. I have on the headband. And he have on a hoop for life shirt. And it's his dad's AAU team. When we came in the studio, he was like, no, you got to put this headband on. It's my dad's <laughs> team. So how's your relationship with him? Like, is he really supportive of your career? Is you really supportive of his team? <laughs> Supportive, he's supportive, but it's like it's like tough love with him. Like he like, mm-hmm. why you go take your whole little work paycheck and spend it at the studio? Right. He ain't got nothing to show for. It. Like, like the rap game, like the rap game is like the NBA draft. Mm-hmm. You know what I'm saying? Only one out of every sixty make it. I, I listen to it, I take heed to it, but at the same time. Like, my passion, like, this what I yeah. did. Like, if I don't make it with this, it's like, yeah. But you got it though. I mean, y'all, once y'all hear his new song, Global, like, it's turned, like, y'all gonna like it. Appreciate it. Appreciate um, it. Are you in school or are you just gonna stick to rap? Or how do nah. you feel about school? All right, the school situation. I'm not in school. But right now, it's like, you know how most, most rappers, you know what I'm saying? I'm having this. I'm having this. I'm having this. I'm having this. I'm going to be honest with you. I ain't got shit. <laughs> I ain't <laughs> Which, got shit. Hey, keep I ain't got nothing. I work, you know what I'm saying? I work in a warehouse job. But 
I worked that warehouse job to to make something happen with my music. You know what I'm Cause I know my I know the vision with my yeah. I got a vision for my music. I know I know the outcome of my music if I put in the proper work. So school I wouldn't say school not a bad thing. Mm-hmm. But I I tell young people, don't waste your time with school if you know, you know what I'm saying? You going to school for this major, but you don't really want to do this in life. You know it's like saying? pointless, like why? <laughs> yeah, but I plan on going back to school though. Give me a business degree. I really want to start a music business. That's my whole. Yeah. Like, I want to start a music business. My family, whatever. What y'all want to do? Y'all want you want a restaurant? You want a beer? You want a beer shop? You want a bar shop? You want a dance <laughs> Right. I, I already got the credentials for this, so. You know what I'm saying? We're gonna make this happen. I'm gonna do the best thing y'all. Y'all gonna make me proud. And we're gonna run it up. All right, I like your mindset. Appreciate it's it. my thought. Now, speaking of businesses and investing and networking, um, have you seen any artists that you would like to link with within the underground scene in Memphis? Underground scene? Yeah. I just linked over with Who? That's no bad. That's no guy, Okay, man. well, I, outside of her. That's no guy, man. Y'all basically Big already. Desto. Like, need y'all, need, y'all need, real talk, y'all need to go follow her Instagram. That's no guy, man. Like, books. <laughs> <laughs> hey, real Look. talk, y'all need, that's no guy, man. I mean, <laughs> hey, that's the remedy. Y'all can't, y'all can't blame me for this. Hey, I don't care if y'all keep that in there, cut it out. I don't care. I'm just... Uh, okay, so I'm gonna give you a list of women. Okay, so I'm gonna say Drea. Do you know who Drea is? Okay. No. Erica Badu. Forget everybody else. I want. I want to marry Erica Badu. Forget everybody else. Game over. Game over. Next subject. All right, cool. Erica Badu. I like Erica Badu. <laughs> this That's is a the game. That's the queen. She is. Erica Badu. Thank you. I love you. I cherish you. So who are, who are the women that you think killing me in the game right now? Killing me in the game? Yeah, like, top women. Like music or just entertainment? Musically. Killing in the game for her. Nikki, like she going hard with the music. But like mm-hmm. Black China, she finished. She not these niggas. She so not, she's not music, game. though. <laughs> Black China is not music. She I'm saying. reality TV. She's entertainment, it's though. Inter- okay, cool. Right. <laughs> so why don't you shout out um, your social media name so all your viewers can know where to find you? Social media. Instagram and Twitter. One, the number one. Vert, V-E-R-T. The Vort. V-O-V-O-Y. It's one, Vert, the Vort. Don't follow me. And I'm rocking with you. It's, it's M T V. Think about to a lot. Bad bitch shoot, not getting say. Ain't about what you make, what you say. Say all the talk about it getting paid. Words are powerful, babe.